today is Saturday. It's finally the weekend. And we don't have much planned, but we got a little bit planned. We are trying to transform Bella's room into baby boy's room. And we're putting, putting Bella in the old guest bedroom, which is a little bigger. She'll have more room to play. So we're really excited about that. But we're trying to kind of like design the room how we want it or how I want it. <laughs> And we have a rug that's already in there. It was a rug that we previously bought. We, we realized it had like more pink in it than we wanted for like our living room. And so we moved upstairs to the guest bedroom. It's real cute. It has multiple colors in it. So we're trying to pull from that rug and um, create like this cute, girly bedroom, toddler room for Bella. I really like the idea of having like a pale blue wall instead of pink like she has enough pink she has plenty of pink in the room we should actually put a, a picture of her current room here but anyway she has plenty of pink in the room so i don't want to do a pink wall so i was thinking like a pastel blue because that's the one color in the room and vincent does not like the idea of blue being in a girl's room which colors that are in the rug are purple, yellow, which is really cute, and orange. We also want, we don't want just a plain colored wall, like a feature wall. We want an actual feature wall. So we're trying to do paneling on the wall, DIY everything, all right? Because what we're not going to do is hire anybody to do this. This is, this is what we're doing ourselves, or Vincent is doing with the direction of his lovely life. We didn't do much, but like just add furniture to Bella's room. So it'll be cool to like personalize it. It'll be nice to bring some like spark to the to each room. We didn't talk about painting, but baby boy. Baby boy. For for his room, like we want to do something obviously like we want to personalize. And for Bella's old room, we just had her name like Ari Bella on the wall which made it like really cute but we want the same type of sign for the new baby but we also want a feature wall for him too like we want his room to be personalized as well so maybe we can figure out a color for him too right now in that room we're going to keep the green rug that we have and then kind of work around that we should just do green we can, yeah, we can do a darker green if you want to do that. That would be cute, actually, like a forest green. Smooth, soft green. Got it. I don't wanna fall in love. I just wanna have some fun, yeah. I don't wanna fall in love. I just wanna have some fun. I don't wanna fall in love. Uh oh. <laughs> God, we finally made it. And I'm tired and breathing hard. But that's all right. Because we here. Violeta, blue, azul, azul, ooh. Okay, what kind of purpose? Like this type? Or like? I like that, but like maybe like a like a like a darker tone like this. People. Like just like a slight tone, like a slight down. What about a green for the other room? I don't think you're doing a good job at <laughs> That's too dark, right? It would have to be like a darker green. But is that too dark? 
Mm. Rainforest. I kind of like it. Let's see how it looks in the rain. Okay. Are we good with these? I don't, yeah. this, I don't think this is going to work. Alright. So these are for Bella's room. And then these are for baby boy. Blue. Azul. Blue. Good job, Azul. Get back in there. Wow. Garage motor right here. We trying to get one and replace ours because ours is the loud one. Yes, we found everything that we need. Now we just have to take measurements for Bella's room. And then I don't know if we wanted to kind of do the same design in baby boy's room, but we're gonna figure it out. And then pick the paint colors. Hopefully the colors that we got, one of them will work out of like... I like the yellow. <laughs> the yellow. He likes the yellow. Uh -huh. Bella, I think your seat is in the back, honey. Up, up, up in the back seat with daddy. It is clearly very close to nap time. <laughs> this whole time she was trying to get in the wrong car. The, like the car next to us wasn't even our car. It was another white one, but she wanted to get in that one instead. Thomas, Tyler's are hilarious. That's all I can say. <laughs> <laughs> So far on our checklist, we have gone to Home Depot without measurements, but we did pick out wall color samples. So we're gonna be able to put it in the room and see which one we like in both rooms. We went to Chick-fil-A, got a little grub, dub, dub. And now we're headed home. Bella's gonna take a nap. And what are we gonna do? Oh, I have a meeting at two o'clock. It is 12.27. I gotta meet with my girls. So in the meantime, we can do the color matching, pick out a color, and take measurements. That's all we got for today. Nothing for the afternoon, or at least I hope. Maybe go outside, or maybe put our feet in the pool. Would you wanna do that, Vincent? Short thing. Short thing. Perfect. We're sitting here looking at the rug and I don't see no purple. <laughs> Do you see purple? Yeah. Look, right here. It's so small. No, there's purple everywhere though. Oh, I guess you just can't like I mean oh, I see purple, it. purple. Okay. Well, so Vincent really likes the yellow, which I see yellow in the rug. Um, which yellow though? 
And then I also see some purple. I think I'm sitting on some purple too. Cause I feel like it was a, it was a whole area with purple in it. And then the blue is definitely what I'm sitting on. <laughs> the blue isn't even that like. Yes, it is. What's that move? You see blue? You see blue? Blue, 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 blue. Look, I'll see that. Look. Honestly, me personally, I want to go with the purple. The purple? He want to go with the color that we see the least of in the rug. Then there's is the is is least to clash with the with the rug. What do you mean clash? Meaning like you don't have purple, like the same color everywhere. So I think the color that we see the most in the center, right, would be like if we pulled a yellow, if we pulled yellow from it, or blue. I don't want that purple now. I mean, it's a little purple, right? No. You can see the purple. I think a purple wall is, a purple wall is girlier, yeah? Yeah. And it's also the co the color of royalty. I like this yellow right here. Roasted corn. Okay. I like corn. I like corn. Out of all these colors, I like. Boom, boom, and that one you're holding. This one. So these are the three that we really like. Roasted corn, permafrost, and grape hyacinth. And now we gotta figure out which one would look the best on the wall. So as far as, like you see the yellow, you see blue, you see purple, purple uh, there. I don't know. And then like you can hold this up. And we can see all the colors together. Not the blue. I mean, the blue would be cute too with that, especially with that face. But... Oh, damn, that, look, that really pops. Yeah, that would look really nice. Let's see. I think the yellow might be it. Yeah, if we can hmm? put them a little farther apart. The yellow will make the, the, the like accessories and the paint, paintings and all the accents really pop in the room. Yeah. I think. Yellow uh, it is. Yeah. Roasted corn. That's crazy, right? You want to roast some corn? Oh, look. Almost like. But look how, look how much, how much more makes things pop. So it looks like we have everything we need. We just got to buy the paint. And probably some caulk. We need some caulk. Yeah. I don't think we need anything. I don't think we need anything else. Might need the little pole thing. We could probably get that from, from the broom downstairs, right? Mm. I'll see if it fits. We have a broom in the garage. New rolls, the little one. Um, and then we got two brushes, one, no, three. And then tape, we got the thinner one here. And then the big one. Why are you breathing hard? Why are you breathing? Why are you breathing hard? Why are you smell? Why are you smell bad? That's not good. Vincent said he wanted tacos for dinner tonight. I asked him to run to the store to get a few things. He also said he wanted guacamole. Um, and I'm always down for eating. All right. So, I asked him to run to the store 
to grab a few things. He should be back in a minute, but in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and start on um, at least making the ground turkey because it was frozen. <laughs> Bella is occupied in the living room. In order for me to get anything done, I have to put something on the TV for her. Typically, I try not to do that because I don't want her to be so dependent upon the TV. If I'm not doing anything, I try to cut it off. Sometimes you need help, and I don't physically have anyone here to help me. <laughs> so the TV it is, I'm sorry. Tastes like nothing. It's like bland, right? I've never had an avocado like that. Thank you guys for watching. We are so excited for this project. Um, I can't wait to see what Bella's room is gonna look like. We already picked the yellow, the popcorn. What is it? It wasn't popcorn. <laughs> mm -hmm. It was popcorn something or corn something. It was corn or something. I don't know. What it was. No, roasted no, corn. Roasted corn. But I'm excited for it. We're gonna doll it up. It's gonna be beautiful. And I think she's gonna really appreciate it. She'll like enjoy being in her room more. And she'll have more space too. So it'll be exciting, it'll be fun. And then um as far as the new baby's room, both rooms are gonna be very beautiful and we're just excited for both of our kids. All three. Choice. I'm already tired. Like I can't imagine. Well, imagine, buddy. It's gonna be great. <laughs> okay, can you get out of my lap? I love you so much. <laughs>